Shush. Shut up. Shush for a second. Come on, man. Quiet. Come on, man. Ah, fine. I'll talk over you. Yeah, yeah. Fine. All right. So welcome aboard, folks. He's bothering me. I'm Admiral Bisk, and today we're playing some more Amnesia the Dark Descent. I have to shout because he won't shut up. Anyway. Fucking, uh... I found a door. I don't know if that's important, but... I'm starting the episode. Uh... Do I just... Not many orbs are left. Can I touch these? Last time, I want to put my hand in there. I want, I want to mess with those gears. Where's the boxes? Where's the bo Shut up! I don't care. Wait, what? I know because Alexander took it and brought it to What? What are you talking about? I'm actually kind of interested in what he has to say now. All of a sudden, say more. Okay. Talking about wire. Okay. He unearthed a number of cavern temples wow. and gathered a whole collection of orbs. Cool. But unlike every other finder since the fall of the Israel Bay, he was able to unshackle the heart you and I connected with the orbs. Huh. He used them and was able to travel far and wide beyond the world itself. Interesting. Good for him. Isn't he just, isn't jo Johan Wire just the cat's meow? Ooh. Oh! 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 Oh, I did a thing. What did I do? Is this something upstairs I gotta mess with? Okay. Cool. Good for you. I wanna go upstairs. Oh, weren't there two rooms that I did? Oh. Oh, hey. My shovel respawned. Yoink. I seem to remember there being two rooms upstairs that I didn't check out. Like, I just immediately said, fuck it, spiral staircase. Let's go look at that. I bet you one of those is the right one. Man mode. I'm gonna, I'm gonna run up these stairs. Run with shovel. They told me never to run with a shovel. I'm gonna do it anyway. Fuck everybody. I'm just running with a shovel. What is that moaning? The ambiance. Yeah, there was like other rooms up here that I just completely... Yeah, over here. In this spot. I just completely skipped that door and that... And that door. What's in here? Anything good? This looks important. And I just skipped it. What? Ooh. Hello. 9th of August, 1839. I can't stop sweating and shaking. The warding ritual was not something of a sane mind. Oh? I did not even realize the dungeon was still in use. Okay. Alexander had his servants bring one of the prisoners, a murderer, he told me. Okay. Alexander made all the arrangements, but he said I had to perform the ritual in order to have the right effect. The shadow could be led astray by the blood of another. Killing the man would provide us precious time. Time? Not what even fix it? Do? Alexander said it had to be done. He is saving my life. I don't have the luxury of argument. Well, you could just not do it. I, well, uh, uh, ooh, bad. Supernatural powers at work. Ooh, gimme. Thank you. And gimme. So what do these do? That did something. What does this do? Yeah. Yeah. Come on. Come on. Come on. Listen, you little bastard. I'm gonna get you. Ooh. That, I did it good. I did it good. What did I do? I... Did I do it good or not? Was that a good? I don't know if I did it good. Did, some, did somebody just say what happened to her? This one won't budge, though. Okay. What was the point of that? What did that do? Was that connected to those gears that I messed with? Is there maybe something downstairs that... Daniel, you have gone too far. I have to stop you. I can't let you proceed any further. I'm sorry, my friend. What? Fuck you. Fuck you there, guy. I'm gonna keep walking. That's what I'm gonna do. Fuck you, do 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 do
Was there something else? Sure. You got the doors open? Good to go. What? I knew you Oh! That's what that did! Ooh! Oh, good! Okay, well, we're, oh, we're going to the left. Light. Hello? Hello? What the fuck? What's this? Oh. What's down there? Maybe I gotta... Is there, do I need water? Is it, do I gotta put a bucket on it? How do I put the bucket on it? Do I have a bucket? I have a glass jar. Can I go... Whoop. Huh. Okay. Maybe not. Maybe I can get like a bucket and tie it on there? And get some water? Is there something down there? That's a water monster. Oh, that's, oh, that's a water monster. Okay, okay. Why is, there, why is there a water monster down there? Am I gonna have to jump down the well at some point? Oh. That's bad. I, I hope that's not the case. Transit. All right, why not? Let's see what this is. The fear had begun to drown him again. He reached once more for the empty bottle of la da 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 in frustration, he smashed it against the button post. Oh, that sucks. What the fuck is this? What kind of cult bullshit? Okay. Okay, spiral staircase. Doing it. How much more, Baron? How much more am I supposed to withstand? Kill me already! Kill me! Is it Daniel? This one. Prepare him. No, it's somebody else. It's one of the prisoners, right? Ooh. What are those rooms? This looks cooler. Going this way first. Listen, I'm swimming, walking up these stairs with such purpose. My name's Daniel. I'm done dealing with your bullshit. Fuck you, Alexander. I'm done with this shit. Ooh, what's this? Chris Fictions. Cool. Okay, what's in here? For safety. Ooh, books. Oil. <gasps> Genie lamp. Oh man, it's never a genie. Where'd it go? I don't go. Ooh, is this rope? What the fuck do I need? <gasps> genie lamp! <laughs> Nothing? Fuck you. Oh. String. Okay, what's the string for? Ooh, no. There are quite a few things to be said about torture. I had figured that the reaction I would get from the victims would be highly individual. Thankfully, this is not the case. The humans all have a very similar approach to dealing with physical pain and the terror of anticipation. Is this written by an alien? I can't stress enough the importance of restraining the victims before proceeding. Even the most timid creature can break out of break out in fists of violence. Fits of violence. I guess fists of violence works too. Where their strength exceeds their expected prowess. If proper care has been put into breaking the victim, this should not be a problem, but it will also hinder the effect I am after. The right steps to take are, therefore, to restrain while the victim is still dazed, proceed by presenting the form of torture you are about to apply, and then to continue with the actual act. The point of presentation is to infuse terror. The human mind is extremely efficient, as it will trigger itself into greater fear. How is that efficient? Simply by imagining it. While applying pain, make sure to avoid massive damage, as it will prove more efficient if the process can be sustained. Also, apply the pain in doses, if possible, with breaks to let the body settle. If you are whipping or cutting the victim, strike once, wait for the pain to subdue, then strike again. As long as the body suffers, it will continue to produce the vitae and, vitae, and saturate the blood with, with its properties. Okay. Only the careful performance will the, with careful performance will the victim yield maximum effect. If the victim doesn't behave as expected, it is likely that they will be for naught. That all will be for naught. Before this happens, feed them the amnesia drink and try again later. Is oh, is that what I drank? Ooh. Ooh. Okay. Interesting. 
Alright, so we're learning a few things. Whatever this Vitae stuff he needs it. Ooh, ooh, ooh shiny! What's this do? Is it you, my love, I miss the most? Or is it perhaps myself? I know what I have become. I am not blind. I am a monster to them. A demonic sultan perched on a dark mountaintop. There's little I can do to redeem myself. The Black Eagle fears me, and after Napoleon's defeat, it is only a matter of time before they do demand my head on a platter. I must remove myself from this land. This time it must work. If I can't return home now, I shall perish. What? The fu- What? Return- What? Was it- Wait. My, when it said my love- it, So was that Alexander talking about that? Are you an alien? <laughs> I think he's an alien. Alexander's an alien. Confirmed. 2015. Alright. So... What's that- the hell do I need string for? Do I put the meat? No. But, uh, I probably don't have whatever it's for yet. Oh, wh whoa, what? Do I do this? Do I combine that with something? Can I, like, tie the two strings together in that room? I'll worry about that later. For now, I'm curious about these doors. Ugh. What's in these? Hello? Oh, it's dark. Oh, it's very dark. Oh, it's very dark. Like that one. Hello? What's uh, going on in here? I'm gonna just borrow this thing. Ow, what is that noise? Ow. Whoa, what the? Ooh, that looks not fun. Although it doesn't seem... Actually, oh wait, the position his arms in makes it looks awful. Ooh. Probably rips your arms out or something. Ew. I don't know anything about... The kidnapper sat on her, knee, on her knees with her hands tied behind her back. She felt her hands being lifted and her body followed. Her shoulders gave way, gave away to the weight of her own body and cracked loudly. Okay, that's what it... Yeah, it rips your shoulders out. The suspended woman cried hysterically as the men contemplated their next step. Okay, yeah. That's what I thought it did. Okay. Uh, I don't know about much of any torch devices. In fact, I found a- Wow, that's heavy looking! Holy tits! Oh, good. It looks like a minion now. Great. I fucking hate those minions. From Despicable Me. They're everywhere right now because that minion movie is like out. Okay, shouldn't have touched that. I get it now. I shouldn't have messed with that. Got it. What's this? Is that an orb? A piece of orb. Sweet. Oh, they're in the torture rooms, aren't they? They're in the torture rooms, aren't they? Calling it. These are all torture rooms, and that's where the orbs are. Good. 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 All right. Well... <sighs> what other kind of torture we got going on? What else can I go witness? Is this somebody dragging him? Is this me dragging him? You, you're a man. How can you partake in this? Is he all right? He is one of the wicked. Don't pay his lies any attention. I'm not a bad man. It was an accident. He set a man on fire. Oh! It wasn't my fault! Why won't anyone listen? That's horrible. What do you mean it wasn't your of fault? Of course. How do you... We are dealing with monsters. You, did you accidentally dr give him a gasoline bath and then light him ablaze? What the fuck is this? No, no, please! I'll do anything! Whatever you want! Anything! I'll do anything! I did that go in his bum? Or did they pull his stomach over? How does this thing work? You got a picture? Can I get a diagram like in the last one? The arsonist kept crying as he was slowly lowered on, on and off the impaler. It didn't take much to break him. They had meant for him to die, but the torture was working beyond their expectations. It wasn't the method, it was the arsonist. He was different from the others. They could make him forget again. The impaler. So, well, I can only assume your feet go there and your hands go there. What? 
Oh, do they move that where they want it? I'm calling it. They put it in your bum. It goes in your butt. That's what happens. I don't know. Alright, guys. I'm all out of time. Where's the orb? I'm all out of time for this one. So if this made you smile, leave it a like. Maybe a little comment. Thanks for watching. And as for the huge, everybody remember to stay gold. Bye-bye.